So today's practice is a body scan. Hence, I'm in this position uh, because usually I do a body scan lying down. So if you have a mat, you can lay out a mat, have a nice cushion to support your head as you lie down. Uh, if not, you can also practice this lying on bed, uh, but maybe holding a slightly stronger intention to keep awake. The intention I have for today, curiosity and uh, a bit of playfulness. So if you're ready, and then go ahead, lie down, and even if you want to sit, actually it's fine to also do this practice sitting. But if you have been sitting all this while, then maybe it's fun to just have a change sometimes. If may begin. And so go ahead and sense of settling into your mat. And as you lay here, and sensing the different contact points between the body and the surface ground. And slowly, maybe bring your awareness to your breath, just to center your focus for a while. Breathing in deep all the way to the belly. And breathing out from the belly. I'm just noticing the moment to moment shifts in sensations and you breathe lying down. Maybe a little bit different from when you're sitting up. You might even feel the different sensations along the back as you breathe and change in pressure points. Maybe as you breathe out, a sense of sinking deeper into the mat. And the body is feeling heavier. Your eyes can be softly closed. <clears throat> At the same time, if you find that um, a bit sluggish or sleepy today, then maybe it's a fine idea to practice with the eyes open as well. So just experiment with yourself in this practice. So the main focus of this practice is really to sense different parts of a body connecting to any sensations within the body in this moment and also practicing that shift in attention whenever you direct the intention to it. So now maybe taking a deep breath in. On the out breath a sense of softening. And the next deep breath in, guiding that breath and attention all the way towards your toes, all your ten toes. 
sensing all ten toes in this moment any sensations that you might feel the big toes the small toes in between the toes maybe a sense of tingling or numbness coolness or warmth or if there's no sensations then registering as no sensations and now taking a deep breath in towards your toes and on the out breath letting go of the awareness around your toes and now shifting the awareness down to the rest of the feet and sensing the soles of the feet the top of the feet the ankles, the heels that's in contact with the mat any sensations around both your feet in this moment And taking a deep breath in towards your feet. On the out breath, letting that feet go. Now shifting that awareness up towards your shins and calves. Any sensations along the shin, the tightness of the skin, wrap around the bones the calves resting against the mat and now taking a breath in towards the shin and calves on the out breath letting go and now shifting your awareness to your upper legs, sensing the thighs, your knees. It's like you're shining a spotlight around the knees, along the thighs, examining any sensations on the surface of the skin, or even going inside if there's any sensations within the muscles, in the joints of the knees and now taking a breath in and on the out breath letting go of the thighs and knees and see if you could just expand your awareness to just sense both legs as a whole seeing again that how our attention can be focused, can be expanded according to our own intention. And the sensing both legs as a whole. Again, temperature, tingling, any kind of sensations that you might feel, or maybe no sensations. That's okay too. What is it like to register a blank? And taking a breath in towards your legs as a whole. And on the out breath, letting go of the awareness around your legs. And now shifting your awareness to the back. Maybe sensing the lower back first. There usually might be a slight gap between the lower back or the mat, or maybe yours is in contact. So what sensations are there in the lower back? And then extending that awareness up to the mid back. The upper back. And sensing the back as a whole 
noticing how maybe as you breathe the different shift in sensations in the back And taking a breath in towards the breath along the spine. On the out breath, letting go. And now shifting the awareness to your arms, both your arms. Sensing the ten fingers. Usually the fingers are quite sensitive so maybe using the fingers to just renew your intention to bring your full awareness to sensing the body then sensing the arm as a whole the wrist the elbows Just as per any other practice, even if you notice that your attention is drifting away or you're falling asleep, the moment you notice, just come back. In this case, come back to sensing the arms. It really doesn't matter. The mind does wonder. I'm taking a breath in towards your arms and letting go and the next in breath sensing the belly and chest the rising and falling the slight tuck in the skin as you breathe in as you breathe out the relief the sensations on the surface even sensing within, you sense the expansion of the lungs, and the heartbeat, or sometimes the movement in our stomach. And taking a deeper breath in towards our body. On the out breath, Letting the awareness around it go. And now bringing the awareness upwards towards our head and neck. Just shining that spotlight around the neck. Acknowledging if there's any tension or tightness. Maybe it's relaxed. And sensing the chin or the jaws. The cheeks, your mouth, the tongue, sensing the eyes, the eyelids, your eyebrows, the forehead, the breath in the nose, the back of the head in contact with the ground or the cushion. Even the sensation of your hair touching your scalp. Now taking a breath in to the head, the sense of the air filling up just beneath the nose. And the out breath, letting that go. The next in breath. A sense of breathing in and out of the body as a whole again. Allowing your breath to fill up the entire body. And the out breath sinking deep. Feeling that deep connection with your body. Feeling that sense of wholeness. A sense of completeness. This body, this moment, whole and enough.
So as we do a lying practice, always take your time to get out of the position. You can always slowly move your fingers or toes first. And as you feel energized and awake again, then maybe doing a morning stretch. And then taking your time to come back. Sitting up, however you wish to. Or you wish to continue to lie here. Your choice. And I'll see you tomorrow.